Oh, um, it's been great with those two guys. I, I really enjoy spending time with them. Uh, the BIG fishing trip was amazing. Uh, we went on Austin's boat um, to like a lake around his house and it was just super fun to relax and hang out with those guys off the court. Like there's no real basketball talk. It was just talk about like, you know, life and just enjoying each other's company. And I mean, Austin, Jaron, those are two just really great guys to hang around. I mean, on the court, they're always in my ear, like in a good way, talking to me, like trying to help me. And I think I've been, like I've always tried to keep an open mind, especially with those guys, because I think those guys definitely have uh, my best interest when they're trying to tell me stuff. Uh, the game, of course, is uh, um, faster in college. Like the players are just, they just move faster. Everything's at a higher pace, like in practice, especially in like the drills and stuff. Drills um, are way faster in high school. High school, uh, like, you know, you can kind of relax in some drills, but in Michigan, especially with Coach Howard, uh, there's no relaxing in drills. You've got to go 110% in every drill. So that's probably one of the biggest things for me. And then another thing is like just uh, the physicality. Like I enjoy uh, being physical and, but like in high school, I wasn't really able to use my body as much because refs would always get like, uh, give me offensive fouls or defensive fouls and stuff like that. But in college, uh, it's more like, um, accepted for you to kind of like throw your body around and I just got to get more used to that because I haven't been able to uh, previously and then <clears throat> something that I feel like I got um, coming into college is just my IQ I feel like I see like um, the game isn't too fast for me uh, like I think it's slowing down a little like especially since I first got here it's definitely slowed down for me um, like mentally uh, seeing plays, uh, seeing cutters, stuff like that, passing is stuff that, you know, I, I think I'm getting a lot better at now um, with the college game. Yeah, um, Austin and Jaron are always great sources for me. Uh, they're older, they're junior and senior. Um, and so they're really, really experienced when it comes to that kind of stuff. They've already had a year in Juwan's system, so they kind of know what he's looking for. So those are easy go-tos. But then if um, something is still just not clicking for me, I'll go to either Jawan or Chris Hunter. Uh, those two coaches are super good when it comes to um, like asking questions from a big man. I, th I think the ceiling for us is, I think one of the highest in the country for sure. I mean, you look at the two studs that we have at the wing position in Franz Wagner and Isaiah Livers, those guys, they make, they're bound for a couple of plays of practice where I'm just like on the other end, just like, dang, I don't know how he just made that shot or made that move. And they'll definitely leave me in awe, especially Franz, because I feel like every time he drives, he always makes it somehow. Like some, he's great at the like little uh, hook shot layup stuff like that. I guess that's his foreign background. He's really good at that. But the team is just really good. I mean, we're so like I think our depth is something that not a lot of people talk about. I think we're easily ten deep this year. I mean, just the amount of talent that we have in the first team and the second team, I think is really good. Like the second team is always pushing the first team. Well, I would say the two teams that we have playing, I wouldn't say first and second teams, but the two teams that start out out there are always pushing each other. I think there's just a lot of great talent um, at all positions. You got Eli and Mike at the um, two guards. You got all the good wings and then you got three really good bigs. So I think it's just a lot of talent all spread around. Yeah, uh, we're aware that we're like Juwan's kind of first children or so to say, like we we're his first project and we were like, We've talked about it. I mean, of course, we, we would have hoped to have like a little five so we could have the next fab five in there. But uh, we have four great players. I mean, the other three freshmen are people who I'm going to be friends with for the rest of my life. Like they're just they're just so fun to hang around, especially Terrence. Um, like I've known him forever. So we have that bond. But Jace and Zeb have been great. I mean, like just hanging around them uh, every day in the living room of our apartment is just fun. Like especially on Sundays when Jace is <laughs> rooting for his Seahawks and I'm rooting for my Bills. Like, we'll both just have that chemistry and then Zeb is just always in there with us. I mean, it's just, it's really fun for us. Um, we're, you know, we're gonna, gonna try to um, leave our legacy as a, the Fab Four, I guess, uh, at Michigan and hope like to kind of cement ourselves with Jawan as his first recruiting class.